All right, guys, it's a little windy, but right now I'm at camp, and I have camp permission to work on this cop car. Um, I don't remember. I'm just going to say a number, but I think it's 2009 for, uh, Ford Crown Victoria. Um, and the reason why we're out here today, actually, is because of the spotlight. So the spotlight does not work. I was told that. So I want to go ahead and remove the spotlight. <clears throat> thing even dings at me but yeah so we're gonna go ahead and remove this spotlight and uh see what the problem is Okay guys, so we just got the nut removed. We're really close. We're getting looser. So I just watched a video of how to remove this. So we're gonna go ahead and screw in this here. And <laughs> got this nut here. Okay, so that's completely off, which means that this comes off now. And it might be the handle, I don't know. But we're gonna go outside the outside of the car, take that part off, and then we're gonna take apart part of the spotlight and see what we can come up with. All right, guys. So I know it's a little windy. Hopefully, it's not too windy for the noise. But we're gonna go ahead and use a flat head piece. Keep in mind, I am doing this with one hand, and it's windy. Go right here, and I'm gonna go ahead and loosen this sucker up. And surely, voila, we have this. So, took the spotlight off. I'm excited. Now we're going. To, now it's going to be about going in an inside building and taking it apart and seeing what's wrong with it. All right, guys. So the spotlight has been completely removed. I'm going to go ahead get this thing all figured out. I might this in this video. It's going to be a one-time thing, but it, I might actually come out with the video later today or maybe tomorrow. But I can see this connection part here. This is the mounting piece, which is actually kind of cool in my book. Um, but yeah, uh, we're just gonna. Uh, there's a couple things I wanted to check and see if it's something with the handle here. Is there something wrong with the handle here? Is there something wrong with the switch here? I could use a, scratch, a flat head here and figure it out. But I know, and by, by I know at the end of this video though, we're gonna figure out what the problem is. I could even take it off my cop car and see if it's the issue. Because if I take off mine and it works and I know it's this issue and this piece can be up to $80 so I don't blame it and then the light itself they get expensive but I would actually prefer to get this thing an LED if I shake it it sounds healthy there's nothing like shaking around which means that it's been dropped or broken but what I did notice was um, just some wear and tear on this thing I mean it's been outside for a while there's a crack right there there's like a crack right there so we're gonna go ahead and take this thing apart and see what we can come up with 